We are packed. Got the van going. Kids are in. Hey. 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 Girls are up there. Made a quick stop at Walgreens to get some red box because you know kids need movies for a long trip. Hey guys, where are we going? Oregon. Oregon. Who's ready for a 22 hour car drive? Not me. <laughs> Oh, it's going to be so much fun. We'll show you a little bit of uh, the sights and sounds of the road over the next couple of days. Zoe's already asleep. We've been on the road for five minutes. <laughs> this, my friends, is Phoenix. Hard to believe. We're probably going to head into better weather in Oregon. Crazy. We're at our first stop. We're in Indio, uh, about three hours in on our trip at Burger King. Girls got their food. Boys got their and orange juice. Yeah, and your orange juice and taking their Dramamine medicine. 19 hours to go. So have a 22 hour drive, which means uh, I'm gonna need some caffeine and I gave up soda about three months ago. So. I'm going with coffee. I hate, hate coffee, and I figure this is my only plan that I could come up with that I will not end up addicted to something. So we're gonna give it a shot and see if I can down this this coffee, the first of probably several on our trip. We're in Los Angeles, California right now. McDonald's. Say hey, everyone. Well, I just talked to Ray. He and the kids have been on the road since about 9.30 this morning. And I just got off work and I miss them so much. I haven't even been home yet and I miss them so much. Uh, it was good to talk to him. The drive's going well so far. Uh, I just wish I was with them. It'll be weird going home to a quiet house and, um, oh gosh, I'm getting all emotional about it because I miss them. I love them. Anyway, I am about to go to a meeting with Pastor Cassidy and Scott to talk worship stuff, so we're going to meet for dinner. I'll show you a little bit of that when we get inside. Huge. Sign the guitar and just no get them, everyone to cheer oh, for them. Okay. We'll do the same thing with the production. Jenny and River here. So it'd be like you coming up there. Stopping their faces. Go ahead. <laughs> Take pictures of me eating. That's just not Just video, nice. not pictures. <laughs> yeah, it's even better. Video. You're welcome. <laughs> Seems like every time Ray and the kids are gone, I decide to color my hair. So this is about to happen. It's pretty much the same color as my natural color. Just gotta cover these grays. I don't know if you can tell, but I have a lot like my temples and underneath. I don't know if you can see that, but it's all in there. And I can't pull my well, I don't like to pull my hair back because it's so gray under there. So yeah, we're going to color it so that if I want to pull it back at the beach, if it's windy, I can pull it back and not be worried about my grace. So yeah, we'll see how it turns out. And the color's on, so we'll set the timer for 25 minutes. And then it's time to rinse. And the finished product. I like it. It brought out a lot more of my red than I expected. I have kind of natural red tones. It definitely covered the grays up, which is what I was going for. But it'll probably take a little bit of getting used to. It's so red. I don't know, what do you think? Let me know in the comments. Sleep. Doesn't look comfortable. Nope. <laughs> Third stop at a gas station, just up outside Sacramento, just past there. So heading towards Redding. 
Uh, we'll see how far I get. It's about 10.30 tonight, so hopefully we can keep going. Got the five hour energy all lined up. Uh, but if not, I'll definitely stop and take a quick nap. Don't want to push it. We're in Ashland, Oregon. It's 2.30. In the morning, so we're making pretty good time. Uh, I don't know if I'll make it the rest of the way. Luke woke up <laughs> when we stopped for gas. Uh, but uh, yeah, not going to any place, uh, Thespian. But we're in Ashland for a short time. Just getting gas, getting a little more, uh, a little something to drink and uh, keep awake with. So doing pretty good. I'm actually really surprised how I feel. I probably will not feel like this in about four or five hours though. So uh, hopefully we can make it there and then I can get some rest. Well, it's uh, about 4.15 in the morning. We're in Roseburg, so we're only probably two and a half, three hours away. But uh, I'm feeling pretty tired, so I'm gonna get a couple hours sleep before we get back on the road. I think that's probably the safest thing to do. So see you in a little bit. It's about six o'clock now, and uh, we've got an hour and 45 minutes of terrible sleep. Well, I didn't sleep for longer than 10 minutes in a stretch. I just could not be comfortable. But, that being said, I do feel uh, much better, so I'm gonna get these last few hours done. To our destination, which is good. So, off we go. We're in downtown Eugene, heading over to get some breakfast. So, we are at Voodoo Donuts. These guys are freaking out as they're all around us. What, you want chocolate? I want the cinnamon. This is not the chocolate. Don't worry. It's a fruit loop one. Marshmallow. I want chocolate. I want chocolate. Down here, look at that, some more donuts. Need a little more traditional donuts down here. All right, Luke's got his bubble gum donut. How is it, dude? Good. Good? How's your pink sprinkle donut? Yummy? Yeah. She said it tastes like Like it? Good? Yeah. Good? Yeah, but mine tastes like crusty. Yeah, and, and then Dad got the big old Hurkin glazed donut. Look at that sucker. Ooh, that's big. Look at that. Look at that next to this. There's that. There's mine. And then the bubble gum also comes with a piece of bubble gum. And you get a bubble gum. I swear, I think that's why they got it. Uh, no, not really. <laughs> oh, hold on. So, I was recording them all taking a bite of this donut, except for I wasn't recording. So, now they take another bite. <laughs> <laughs> this is our family donut. It's ginormous. Look at it, Ina. Yeah. Luke. Good stuff. All right, Zoe's turn. Whoa! That was a big bite. Judah. Yikes. Now it's dad's turn. All right, got my donut. Well, what's left of the donut after the kids each had a couple of bites. It's huge though, look at this sucker. Look at that. It's bigger than your face. <laughs> it's good. It is like being my face. Pick a move. They also got the bacon with maple bar. Bopping. So that looks pretty tasty too. Yum. There's somebody in the 
Try the bacon on the maple bar. Give me a verdict and how it tastes. Fucking. Awesome? You said fucking. Good. Good? Okay. <laughs> how is it, dude? Get over that point. Good. Good. Grandpa's hooking them up. <laughs> Five years of this store. It's Tuesday night and I just got done with my workout. I didn't get up this morning to do it and I thought about doing two tonight because I didn't get up yesterday either. Uh, but I can't do it. I, it's so hot. I'm like dripping with sweat and it's gross and I'm hungry. So we're going to call it. I'll get up tomorrow and do one and then do yoga probably when I get home before heading to the airport. So yeah, it was a good workout. Glad I did it. Now I'm gonna go make some food. Got some chopped veggies ready to go. The chicken mixture is ready. I'm just gonna form the meatballs and get these in the oven. All right, the meatballs are ready to go in the oven at 410 degrees. And they're more plopped in there than really rolled into balls. Like these first ones look okay, but the chicken is pretty sticky, so it's hard to get them rolled. But I just portioned them out as two ounce portions. The instructions actually say one and a half ounces, but a serving of chicken for me is four ounces. So I wanted two two ounce meatballs rather than uh, one and a half ounce meatballs. So. Time for these to go in the oven. All right, they're done. And it smells good, it looks good. I'm super hungry, so it's time to combine everything together. And there we are. It looks delicious. The rice should be ready, and I am so ready to eat. All right, here we go. The recipe I made tonight is called Chicken Teriyaki Meatballs. It's from Fit Man Cook, and you can find him on YouTube. Um, and overall, I liked it. I liked the meatballs a lot. Um, the sauce, I used a store-bought sauce. The recipe gives instructions for a homemade sauce, and maybe that would be better. I felt like the sauce that I bought was a little salty, so the dish was a little salty. Um, so I probably wouldn't use that sauce again. I would try to make my own next time. And I'm not, still not a huge fan of broccoli. I did eat some of it. The bell peppers were good though. Overall, I liked it. And I'll probably make it again. Just with my own sauce. Right, come, come with me. All right, girls got new PJs. Yes, Ooh, look how cute it. they are. I got, got Batgirl and Peppa. What's Peppa say? Peppa Pig, what's Peppa say? What's Batgirl do? She saves people. She saves people. Do you save the day? Yeah. Hey, so we are getting ready to go to bed. It's about 10.30. Josiah is the only one of the kids up. Um, so we're over at uh, Carol's family. So uh, Ron and Renee are awesome and always so gracious. And, inhospitable so appreciate that doing our first uh, vlog without Carol so it's a little bit odd but um, man we we made it. it took us about 24 hours with a couple hours to stop and uh, the kids were really good actually um, they're a little bit restless once we got out of the car because they've been cooped up for a day uh, but overall it was really really good uh, just finishing up some stuff for uh, tomorrow's post and then obviously uh, also getting lined up for a few other things Carol's coming in tomorrow we're gonna go to Chuck E. Cheese with my dad uh, Thursday we're heading to the beach with my mom and my sister and her five kids and husband so it's gonna be a great time so anything you want to say like and subscribe like and subscribe people peace out peace <laughs>